we're sitting in that dispatch receipt, and I just looked at the minutes, there's nothing here in the minutes, but I guess the only way of really finding out is to go back to the tapes. But the I contract was always time and a half. I believe he said it was double. I'm just well, I'm the, one, I'm the one the one who got the time and a half for the patrol, because I didn't like working with dispatch, and I didn't want to go. Okay. Um, and I will allow for the possibility that it is, because I don't have the contract with me right now. But the bottom line is that when you have a dispatch vacancy, somebody's going to sit there with a time and a half, with double time. It's not a position where you're going to have some, a bench warmer, like you have a lot of patrolmen out there warming the bench. 14,000 incidents, that's the same number of incidences that we had when Kevin Gray said we had a major crime problem in this town. One third of that number is just door checks that called in. I'll be another one third of those numbers are for medical aid, which has always been a primary area of concern, primary response area for the PD. And then you get down. Yes, we have drugs, we maybe have some prostitution, yes, but no more than any other town. Mr. Russo, I got one comment. I wasn't going to say it, but I have to because I, 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 I do need to. I do need to defend. I do need to defend the board. I think in this. It's I mean, you like my sneakers. Well, I, I do like your sneakers. <laughs> yes, they're bright. But I, I think what a board member said in, in the exact words were: if it's above nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents, it needs to go to town meeting. In fact, he was actually saying it's above 9,900. He wasn't saying, oh, well, let's get it to 9,000. He's like, is it above 9,999 dollars? It's got to go to town meeting. Well, Hence agreeing with you, so I don't anyway, know. Anyway, I may have misheard. Yeah, I mean. I, I may have yeah. misheard, but I did hear, or what I perceived to be, the discussion on how to avoid bringing it to a town meeting. So in and one other question between we're, we're talking that they're out of money for the 2017-2018 budget already. Is that correct? That's correct. In overtime. The overtime. Yeah, yeah. This uh, I this just, budget. Budget. Just they have to plenty of money in the budget. Was it that they've come back and asked for additional money for contingency? They are funding this overage out of their own budget. Well, I would never call, call anybody a liar, but I will say it's a great and stating the truth. Any additional public input? I have a suggestion for your overtime. Michael, problem. hold on. Michael, hold on. Hold on. We're going to finish up and we can. Nope. Well, public got on the uh, board member input. Anything you want to problem years ago they talked about adding a second dispatcher and I don't know if uh, Carol remembers but the thing is is if you added a second dispatcher at regular pay you could have somebody actually call out and you could actually run with just the one dispatcher and not have to fill that second dispatcher position saving you the overtime would you have two dispatchers at the same time? Correct. Then you're raising your overall rate because there's only one right now. Right. right. But the thing of it is, is that on occasion, and Carol was a dispatcher, she'll tell you, there are times that it got so crazy in there during a major incident that that one dispatcher can't handle it all on their own. And it ties up one of your officers from patrolling the streets because they have to assist the dispatcher. So if you had two dispatchers, you would have two dispatchers that could work the desk and not tie up an officer, and you would still have a dispatcher that could cover an open slot if somebody called out sick. I think if you compare that double pay thing to the current budget right now. But what is the overtime costing you? you? I don't know what the overtime budget is. You would have to do the math to figure out if it went. Unless the overtime was equal to. I don't 